That's a little better. That's what good pussy sounds like. Hey man, it's Mike again with uh, Bonus CBD. Today we're actually going to be talking about how to make some uh, some edible brownies or cake or whatever you want to call it, man. But today we're actually going to be doing uh, Hometown's CBD tincture. And then we're also, it, it, it takes a little while to cook in the microwave. So while we're cooking in the microwave, we're actually going to be talking about their gummy bears at the same time too. So to start this off though, we just tried out their tincture by itself without cooking with it to actually see how good this tincture is. I fuck with it, man. It's actually a really good tincture. It has a good, nice taste to it. It's not too earthy. You, you have a little hemp taste to it, but that's fine. It's so mild. It's actually kind of pleasant. Unlike a lot of these other tinctures that I've messed with, man, I actually feel a little something off this. A lot of these other tinctures, in my opinion, man, they're bullshit. It's all a bunch of snake oil crap. This one's good. I like it. I fuck with it. All right, so let's go ahead and start cooking with this, man. You don't have to use the products that I'm using right now. You can use any ice cream, any cake batter. But what I'm using is what I personally prefer. To me, it seems to just work better. All you got to do, man, is get one of these pint of ice cream. Get rid of like half of it and let it get melted at, melted down because that's essentially that's your milk, your eggs, your oil. And you just throw some cake batter, some tincture in it, throw it in the microwave, you're done. But all you got to do, man, so you don't have to make a mess and everything, you just get a knife, cut some vent holes in it. And that's it, man. That way you don't have to put it in a fucking pot and shit. You just throw it in the microwave. There's no mess. Everything stays contained inside this ice cream container because, dude, nobody wants to clean shit up. Come on now. Let's let's be real. Dude, when I was uh, when I was a bachelor, yeah, I I did this. I fuck with it. I did this all the time just because I don't like cleaning dishes. I don't like dishes, man. It's it's too much work. Fuck that shit. Now, the cake batter, obviously. That is too much cake batter for this one recipe. You just kind of more or less eyeball it, but it's like half the bag. So yeah, that was like about half the bag. And that's, honestly, that's it, man. That's all this recipe calls for. It's stupid simple. And then just for good measure, we're going to uh, gonna throw some tincture up in there. Yeah, it was about half a bottle. Half a bottle of tincture. And now, you just mix all that batter up, and that's, honestly, that's it. That's all you have to do to make this fucking cake. You just stir it around until it turns into a cake batter. Then, uh, zap it in the microwave, man. All right, so what I'm doing is I'm adding a little bit more cake batter. It literally needs to have the consistency of cake batter. So if it's still a little too runny, add some more cake batter, and then just keep stirring it up. Keep mixing that shit up, man. Uh, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but there's like little fucking balls and shit. You want to do, okay, we're using a fucking flimsy ass plastic spoon. At your home, you have such wonderful tools as like a whisk and all that shit. Um, you want to try to get rid of all those balls of batter the best you can. You don't have to be too precise because, I mean, honestly, who, th this is fucking bachelor shit. Like, bachelors don't give a fuck about this. But that's it, man. You want it nice and battery like that. All right, so you want it to be as consistent as this. A nice, rich, creamy batter. And that's it, man. That's all you need for this recipe to be done. And as you can see, it's not all the way to the top. But when you zap it in the microwave, that bitch is going to expand quick like. And then you just throw your vent on top, and that's it, man. That's, that's all you got to do. Uh, obviously, the camera can't follow me because I'm going to go to the back of the shop. That's where our microwave's at. Literally, all I'm going to do is zap it for like five minutes. That's it. I will be back. And now I'm, I'm back from the uh, adventure to the microwave. It's just going to zap for five minutes. While we're waiting on that, let's go ahead and talk about Hometown's actual, their gummies, man. Um, Do y'all want some gummies? Yeah, I'll take one. 
All right. So they, they make different flavors. You have a watermelon, a strawberry, a lemon, and a blueberry. Right now, the one that we're going to be doing is the blueberry gummies. We've taken it before. We know exactly what to expect from these gummies. They're pretty solid gummies compared to a lot of these other gummies that are just fucking bullshit. All right, so as you can see, man, they have a lot of nice crystals on the gummies. Unlike some of these other ones, man, they, they're just fucking dirty tasting. This one has not a lot of nice sugar crystals on it, so it actually tastes fucking good. And they're actually pretty strong little gummies, man. They're, um, the whole container is 250 milligrams. You get 10 CBD gummies in it. Each gummy bear is actually 25 milligrams of CBD pretty good for a gummy i'm a more seasoned cbd user i take two because i want to feel a little something something as i was saying man if you want something that tastes good easy to take and is very discreet i recommend these gummies man they're they're just simple they're easy i have no complaints with the gummies at all and this tincture is actually really wonderful i love this tincture it's a good one all right so the cake's done i'm gonna go grab it and i'll be right back all right as you can see, I said no mess. There's room for air. I went ahead and preemptively put a paper towel in the microwave. Really glad I did that. I recommend you probably do that too. Cause uh, yeah, it kind of exploded. But all you gotta do, man, is you just get a plate and bam, that's it. Fucking hot. Um, let's get this knife. Fuck. Fuck, it's hot. So normally this cake is supposed to be in the shape of the uh, ice cream container. But as you can see, epic failure. It smells really good. It smells like a cake. It, it smells how it should. Let's take a bite. See how it tastes with all that tincture in there. That's a big fucking bite. Holy shit. Fuck it, I'm a barbarian. I don't give a shit. I'm a fucking yeah, so I don't give a fuck. Those taste pretty good. Yeah, and it's fucking easy. It just didn't come out as intended. As you can see, dude, it was super easy to make. There was absolutely no effort in doing this. The hardest part is cutting some vent holes into the ice cream. Dude, you got a girl over or something, and she has and she wants some nice fucking feel good food just whip this out man she's gonna think you're badass that's it throws a little bit of cbd in there make it feel real good netflix and chill brother that's it that's all you that's all you gotta do man sure this example doesn't look the best but i'm telling you man you can make it where it literally looks just it's in the shape of the ice cream like a muffin yeah it's like a giant muffin and then another thing i used to do man you can get like some hot fudge sundae and you put hot fudge sundae all over it. Oh, yeah. On point. That's it, man. That's all there is to it. Now, so let's talk about the uh, the tincture by itself versus um, inside the cake form. So by itself, you actually taste the hemp hempness. In the cake form, I use like half the bottle. Y you don't taste any of the, the, the hempiness in the cake. It just tastes like a brownie. Other than that, man, I mean, I still feel the same effects. The only difference is you no longer have that hemp taste. It's just CBD tincture. That's it. Mixed with brownie mix. All right. So we can't give you the promo code for the tincture right now because we don't have this yet. We This was a test product. We wanted to get it in, see how well it was, and then go from there. So stay tuned for this promo code. So we're going to give you a promo code for the gummies this week. Pro, the promo code is going to be Blueberry Yum Yum. Blueberry Yum Yum, that's your co uh, promo code. Again, website only, not in the shop. That's it, man. All right, so stay tuned. Catch us next week, and uh, we'll be right back with y'all, man. Y'all have a good one. Hey, man, be sure to check out our two videos down at the bottom. And uh, if you like our shit and fucking support us, man, uh, like, comment, share, subscribe, do all that shit. Hit that fucking bell. Y'all have a good one. BonusCBD.com